guys, it's Sherri Ann. Welcome back to my channel. It is a new month, so that means it is time for a Trader Joe's grocery haul. So I went to Trader Joe's today with the intention of getting so many fall Thanksgiving things and it was a madhouse in there. It actually took me about an hour to get everything I needed and it wasn't even that much. There were just so many people and when I was talking to the woman who was ringing me up, she was saying how Mondays are their busiest days. So now I know for the future, but I do have some stuff here, stuff I definitely have to put away. So let's just get started. The first thing I got was this organic jasmine rice. I'm actually running really low on the rice that I got from the Filipino store when I first moved here to New York. Um, I bought rice at the Filipino store in New Jersey and I brought it here and I'm running low on that. And so I was just gonna get the Trader Joe's jasmine rice and then they didn't have any, they said. So I just got the one that you can put in the freezer, which is fine. I've used it before and it's totally fine, but yeah. And then the last two things in that bag are just some chicken breast tenders and also some sirloin steak tips. I don't typically eat a lot of red meat, but I wanted to just mix up my meal prep situation a little bit because I always make chicken and sometimes you just need something different. I got some Mexican style shredded cheese. I'm going to make chicken fajitas, kind of, and I just wanted to get some of that. So this is actually something that they have for Thanksgiving. I, I remember last year trying to find this in Florida and I couldn't, and I think I just knew about it too late, but it's the turkey and stuffing en croute. It is a turkey tenderloin wrapped in cornbread stuffing and puff pastry. This goes in the freezer. I know they also have a vegan type like version of this, which they did not have at my store here. Um, I, however, just thought it'd be interesting to get um, and have sometime this month. I'm going home for Thanksgiving since I'll be off or I'll have like Thanksgiving break for class. But I just wanted to get this. I can keep this in the freezer. It's fine. Hopefully it tastes really good. I think people have said it's good. I actually also really think that this is a good option if you're doing like a Friendsgiving or a Thanksgiving party before Thanksgiving to have that on hand. I don't know. Okay, so I also saw this. I've never seen this before. I don't know if it's new, but I love tomato soup. So it's the Trader Joe's Papa Al Pomodoro. It's a Tuscan inspired soup made with Italian tomatoes, rustic bread, and extra virgin olive oil. That's what it looks like. You get this in the frozen section. I'm pretty sure it's just the soup and not bread in here. So when I eat that, I'll have to I'll probably buy bread or croutons or something. Oh, I got some of these <laughs> just to keep on hand. I've gotten these before. It's just the Bambino pepperoni pizza. I got some light sour cream. I have never purchased sour cream from Trader Joe's before, but I figured why not? I was trying to just do a one-stop grocery shop <laughs> this week. I didn't want to have to go to multiple grocery stores, um, which means that I did not buy any fruit this week, but I still have some apples left, so it's okay. Anyway, yeah, so I got Trader Joe's sour cream. Never had this before. Even in the regular sour cream version from like Daisy or anything, I always buy the light or reduced version just because I find it doesn't upset my stomach as much. I got some Parmesan Reggiano cheese, the shaved version, which is my favorite kind to get. And then this is one of my favorite things from Trader Joe's. It's the turkey cranberry apple salad. Uh, I remember last year I discovered I think during vlogmas i discovered this that they put this sometimes on their sandwiches after thanksgiving and it is so good so i figured i'd just pick some up for myself to have during lunch in between classes this stuff i remember getting last year and i really liked it i think i'm pretty sure i like these things separately so i don't know why i wouldn't like it but it's so potent you can't like i personally can't have a bunch of this because it's so strong it's the horse radish horse <laughs> Oh gosh, okay, it's the horse radish and chives potato chips. 
these are so good i only got one bag because i know this will probably last me quite a while i don't typically get things like this at trader joe's but this looked so good to me and i'm trying to figure out what kind of pie dessert makes to make for thanksgiving this year um so i got this this is the trader joe's french apple tart uh there's a sticker over it but it's a baked apples and a shortbread crust with a hint of i think apricot and vanilla and it just it looks delicious the only ice cream i have on hand is coffee ice cream but i bet you that would still look so good or go so well with that <laughs> for the fajitas i'm going to make this week i got uh, a yellow and orange bell pepper i prefer or yellow and orange ones to red or green ones i think they just taste nicer i also think they have higher levels of vitamin c which really important during this time of year i have a yellow onion for my fajita i have never gotten these before but they looked and sounded the best to me these are corn and wheat tortillas so it's soft <laughs> Oh my gosh, I can talk. It's soft yellow corn tortillas with a unique blend of corn and wheat. This is what they look like. They also smell really good. I got a little garlic bulb for my steak. I also got some little teeny tiny potatoes. These are so tiny. They're kind of like fingerlings, but I think even smaller than that. Um, just to make and keep on hand if I want to eat it with anything this week i got some red chili pepper because i realized i didn't have any and last week when i was making roasted vegetables i really wanted to put this on there and i didn't have any so i just picked up some of that i got some zucchini to make zucchini noodles i got a cucumber this is an english cucumber um to have at lunch i got some grape tomatoes so i went to trader joe's looking for thanksgiving stuff and or seasonal things that only come out during this time of year i didn't get a ton of that i got the horse radish and chive potato chips which are not always around the turkey and stuffing on croute the turkey apple salad the french tart the other thing i really really wanted that they did not have were the mini marshmallows and i was really really looking for those but they didn't have them what they did have was their christmas holiday stuff out already they had so much stuff out one of the end caps on the aisles was already dedicated <laughs> that was weird was already dedicated to just christmas stuff and then by the frozen section where they keep some of the cookies and candies they already had christmas stuff out they had their advent calendars out already well, I guess most places have their advent calendars out, but you know what I mean. Anyway, so the two things I got are the Scandinavian tidings, which are similar to the Scandinavian swimmers, just that these have a different flavor to them, obviously. I've had these before and I like them. So I'm just gonna hold on to this for the holidays. And then the other thing I got is something that I very distinctly remember trying with my mom during vlogmas last year we tried it tried it on camera it's the peppermint bark popcorn the caramel popcorn coated in dark chocolate and enrobed in a white chocolate and peppermint candy coating i think she liked this more than i did but it sounded good to me today so i got some of those so that's it for this week's grocery haul or well that's probably gonna last me a while let me know if there are any other thanksgiving things that I missed at Trader Joe's. My favorite time of the year is coming up, which is Christmas and the holiday season, like the winter holiday season. So I will probably be picking up a lot of things then, even if I'm not gonna eat all of it right away. Um, that was the thing with the Trader Joe's Thanksgiving stuff. A lot of it was frozen, like the savory corn pie or the broccoli and cauliflower gratin or the tomato or the tomatoes or the potato gratin i just couldn't justify getting those because i knew i wasn't really gonna eat them if you guys like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and i will see you all next time bye guys